Hello and welcome back to Life as Usual. Today, I'm going to replace the rear rocket blade. We've had issues in the previously. We couldn't put the rear rocket blade into the service position if you didn't know what that is you need to see my other video basically there's a way to put the white blade in service position for you to easily change it now why do i need it to be in the service position because this is in the way of replacing the wiper blade so uh, i'm gonna do a bit of uh, manual work what i'm gonna do is i'm going to remove this trim which is called a spoiler and to do so of course once i remove it i'm gonna be able to access the wiper blade there are three screws that it requires to be removed so I'm gonna remove it I'm gonna get the correct size and if you were wondering it's number 10 it's the 10 millimeter now you may need a torque driver to take it out I have taken it out previously so that's why it's easy for me but if never ever took them out before, they may need. Now, they're not long screws, so make sure you don't lose them. They're short ones. And with that out of the way, next I need to close this and make sure it's all closed. Now you can see it's loose, and what we need to do is pull it in the front as such. Okay. Now, just make sure it's all the way. Now, we lift it. Be careful, there are wires behind. I'll show you. Now, if you don't want to go through the trouble of removing the wires and bother about it, you can just leave the trim here. Don't have to do much about it. I'm actually going to ask the lovely wife who's filming <laughs> at the moment to hold this one for me, actually. Would you mind holding of it? Of course. Yeah. Yeah. Without breaking it. No, it's fine. If you just hold it this way. Yeah, sure. That'd be great. Mm -hmm. Would you mind holding it this way? Yep. Yeah. So that's good. Now she's gonna multitask. Mm -hmm. She's gonna hold that trim and film at the same time. So yes. bear with me. So what I'm going to do, I'm just gonna put this one here. And as usual, I'm gonna put microfiber under this. Just in case it snaps back and I don't want it to snap back on the glass. So I'm happy. So I'm able to work this way. Yeah. So I'll just put this one here. So what you need to do is turn it that way. So it's the opposite. And then what we're gonna have to do, there's a trim here. And what I need to do is I need to press on this and pull down. You don't do it this way. You have to flip it all the way out and then that's out. That's perfect. And now that is out, just turn it around and bring it all the way out. That's how it looks like, if you were wondering. That's how it looks like from inside. So it was like this, yeah? And it goes that way, so that's how it was. I'm gonna put this away. I'm going to get a brand new wiper blade. Open it. From Land Rover, this original blade. That is the number, if you were wondering. We were saying that it goes this way, and basically, if you notice, it looks like a hook that goes up and it goes back down. And what needs to happen is it needs to go up this way and back down from here okay and this would have to hold it from here so to do so we're gonna have to put it this way but if you think about it if we twist it this way then we're gonna need it this way so instead we'll do it from here okay and we put it from this side then from this side push up and that clicked in okay now it's not going down if we want to put it down press on this one and push it down but if you can hear I'm gonna go up again and click and that clicked in now we turn it this way and down to do it one more time to take it off we would open open it this way press on this one and down like this yeah so now just want to show you how it's done so we want to put it up this one away put it through this like so and up and you can hear it clicking 
and that's that's it and if you want to remove it we click on this one like that and we'll push down like so that's out that's out put it back in again this way and up and you can hear it clicking and that's it so next what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put uh, this one back and i will show you if that's it that's it honey okay now we're gonna put this this away now now that this is in the correct position we're happy about it you can see here there's a piece of rubber and then here like an oval shape and then here a piece of rubber what we need to do is put it here and slide it put it here and slide it this goes here so i'll show you if you look closely i don't know if the camera in the camera may not get it if you look from here from here i'm just yes go down just aiming that's it that's it and it's the same thing on the other side okay and once it's in we'll push all the way in and you can see if you lift from here lift from here it's not going anywhere that means it's in now we need to put the three screws back and to do so of course we need to open this again now i have removed this trim so you can see better let's put these three screws back i mean, if i remember mentioning that these small screws so put them back That's done. That's done. That's done. And if you were wondering about the trim, this is the bonus additional information. Here, let me put the screw back. So there are tabs over here. I've damaged one already, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And they go here. It's not here. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, and the ninth goes here. Okay, so just be careful how you do it. Okay, bit back. We're just going to align these ones. Starting from here. Align them both these ones. Try to start from the bottom. I notice if you start from the bottom, it's easier than to the top. You should hear it. That's it. That's it. That's all it is. And now the trim is back in. Wiper blade is in. The spoiler in. No movement. Perfect. It's all in. You can see. Voila. Thus, I replaced the rear wiper blade. You may wonder why I'm changing the wiper blade. It is because I am preparing the car for an adventure. You may wonder, where is this adventure? Well, you can know more about this adventure on our other channel, which is called Adventures and Experiences. For now, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. There are more videos of Range Rover on this channel, so check it out if you like. With this in mind, bye-bye.